Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply. This video is to bring you a closer look at the Dorma number DC-0146-010. This is a ball catch assembly uh, that's going to be used on their ESA uh, style door. Okay, We will take some dimensional properties of this. Let's do that now. So the height of the faceplate, that's going to be about 3 and an eighth. The width of the faceplate is about 9 sixteenths. Thickness of this faceplate, if I'm just going to gauge that on the camera, it's about an eighth of an inch. The overall depth of the body, including the spring assembly, looks like it's about an inch and 7 sixteenths. The overall height of that appears to be about an inch and 7 eighths. Uh, this roller latch is used in a sliding door assembly, and you might think, well, why would you use it in a sliding door assembly? Well, sliding doors have a breakout functionality. In case there is an emergency, that door, that sliding door, can be broken out or forced out, and the ball catch, or the roller latch, is what keeps the door in the closed position, so to speak. So these automatic sliding doors slide, but they can be broken out to act as uh, emergency exits. And that's what this is for. Let's switch to the screen view and I will show you the small amount of supporting information that I have. If you've not hit subscribe yet, we would very much appreciate if you did and hopefully you're enjoying this video. Now let's get back to it. Here are some images that we have of this roller latch. Uh, you'll take note of these two Allen drive uh, bolts here. That's what's going to set the tension ultimately on the roller latch, meaning it'll th it'll alter the projection of the roller and therefore increasing or decreasing the amount of force it takes to break the door open. Red lock is what that blue is that's there. The back side of the unit. Now I also do have a parts drawing uh, that I've been able to find on this. The 0416 shows up twice, shows up on a ESA 300 sliding door, spring detent latch assembly, um, unfortunately they don't uh, show that so easily here. so clearly is what I mean to say. Ah, here it is. But they call it a DC... Oh yeah, sure. There it is. I do not know what these are, but this is probably the strike that goes with it. DC 0146. Uh, where exactly it goes... It'll be a matter of you... The, the roller latch and sliding doors and them being breakout is very common to sliding doors, so where it's exactly positioned will be a matter of the unit that you have. But this drawing does not show it, and I do not know exactly where it's positioned, so we won't, um, we won't tell you where it is because we don't know. Okay, uh, there is a link below this video to the manufacturer's page as seen here. And the only reason that's important is if we have any supporting or encyclopedic documents on DORMA low or high energy automatic doors, it would be on this page. If you have any questions on the DC0146 roller latch or any other DORMA product, please let, let us know. Thank you. Thank you for watching, and if you've enjoyed this video, please click thumbs up, please subscribe, and maybe even send the video to someone that you know. Thank you.